Okay, welcome to my new series. And that is more of your internet questions answered. So let's go ahead and do it. Okay, how did the MLB find out about the Astros cheating? On November 12th, The Athletic, the world's most reputable uh, newspaper, reported that Mike Fires, who pitched for the Houston Astros, had revealed that during his tenure with the team, the Astros secretly stole signs from visiting teams, intercepting communications. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, my God. Why did Fires not it expose them while he was on the team and waited till he was taken off the playoff roster? Okay, number two. Do all MLB teams steal signs? According to the unwritten rules of baseball, stealing the signs that are given by the third base coach or those of the catcher by a base runner or second base is acceptable. And it is up to the team giving the signs to protect them so they're not stolen. I want to ask what year were binoculars and baseball put together? <laughs> they probably did. Okay. Are there any MLB teams that haven't won a World Series? Okay. The Seattle Mariners are the only current MLB franchise that has never uh, appeared in a World Series. Padres, Rockies, Rangers, Tampa Bay Rays have all played in the series but never won it. Okay, how did Cora steal signs? MLB investigators identified Cora as the central figure in an illicit scheme to steal opposing catchers' signs via a video feed and communicate them to the Astros hitters as recorded by the most amazing commissioner ever, Rob Manfred. Who will replace Alex Cora? Boston has found a temporary replacement in the dugout, Ron Renneke. Okay. What is electronic sign stealing in baseball? Sign stealing is a long-standing baseball practice in which one team tries to decode the signs of its opponent. Those signs could be relayed from the catcher to the pitcher. What does a buzzer, buzzer, what does a buzzer do in baseball? A buzzer was set up to alert someone in the Giants bullpen of the pitch call. And he would, in turn, relay it to the batter. Oh, my God. How long has sign stealing been around? Shh. The conversations about hand signals and st sign stealing ha have resurfaced an old baseball legend that hand signs as we know them were popular popularized by deaf baseball players in the 1880s. Has there ever been a World Series where the home team lost every game? With the National 6-2 win in Game 7, the juggernaut Astros, who won more games than any other team in baseball this season, made an unfortunate kind of history. Mark this down as the first seven games in baseball, NHL, or NBA history in which the home team lost every game. Oh, my God. Okay. Can a World Series title be taken away? If we're talking about the Astros, this is a scandal that will be brought up. But as for the World Series title, it's never been taken away from a team before and won't be now. I think the precedent was that 1919 Black Sox scandal or whatever. Nobody can take away the fact that the World Series happened. What are buzzers used for? A buzzer or beeper is an audio signaling device which may be mechanical, electric mechanical, or piezoelectric. Typical uses of buzzers and beepers include alarms, devices, timers, and confirmation of user input, such as a mouse click or keystroke. Did the Red Sox steal signs? No, they didn't. 
Red Sox reportedly used video to steal signs during the 2018 World Series run. It's cheating. Major League Baseball says it will investigate allegations the Red Sox used during the 2018 World Series championship season. Uh, Let's see. Will the Dodgers win the World Series? I already know the answer to this. No, (laughs) they won't. The Dodgers have a 45.5% chance to win the National League pennant and have a 29% chance to win the World Series. And you can reduce that by 20 more percent as long as they have Kershaw and Bellinger. Because you guys know me, the only thing that matters is playoff DNA. Every sport, every person, when the pressure's on, do they crack like an egg over a skillet? Okay. Who did the Dodgers beat to get to the World Series? The Dodgers lost to the Houston Astros and to the Boston Red Sox. Okay. What were the Dodgers called before? Okay, I don't even care. I don't even care. Anyway, that's my video. Hopefully you guys liked it. And uh, we're going to do more uh, your your most favorite questions answered uh, later. Take care.